A train 75 meters long takes 10 seconds to cross a man walking at 7 kilometers per hour in the direction opposite to that of the train. Find the speed of the train. Let the speed of train be x kilometers per hour. As the train and man are moving in the opposite direction, their relative speed is the sum of their speeds. The relative speed is equal to speed of train plus speed of man is equal to x plus 7 kilometers per hour. As length of train is in meters we convert the relative speed in kilometers per hour into meters per second by multiplying with 5 by 18. Relative speed between man and train is equal to x plus 7 into 5 divided by 18 meters per second. Speed of train is equal to length to cross man divided by time taken by train to cross man. Here speed is the relative speed between man and train as they are in motion and the length to cross the man is the length of train which is crossed in 10 seconds. Relative speed of train is equal to length of train divided by time taken to cross man is equal to 75 divided by 10 is equal to 15 by 2 meters per second. Forming an equation equating the relative speed derived in terms of x above and the relative speed of the train found out. x plus 7 into 5 divided by 18 is equal to 15 divided by 2, implies x plus 7 is equal to 15 into 18 divided by 2 into 5, implies x plus 7 is equal to 3 into 9, implies x plus 7 is equal to 27, implies x is equal to 20 kilometers per hour. The speed of the train is 20 kilometers per hour. Let us see another example. A train 130 meters long takes 4 seconds to cross a man walking at 6 kilometers per hour in the direction opposite to that of the train. Find the speed of the train. Let the speed of train be x kilometers per hour. As the train and man are moving in the opposite direction, their relative speed is the sum of their speeds. The relative speed is equal to speed of train plus speed of man is equal to x plus 6 kilometers per hour. As length of train is in meters we convert the relative speed in kilometers per hour into meters per second by multiplying with 5 by 18. Relative speed between man and train is equal to x plus 6 into 5 divided by 18 meters per second. Speed of train is equal to length to cross man divided by time taken by train to cross man. Here speed is the relative speed between man and train as they are in motion and the length to cross the man is the length of train which is crossed in 4 seconds. Relative speed of train is equal to length of train divided by time taken to cross man is equal to 130 divided by 4 is equal to 65 by 2 meters per second. Forming an equation equating the relative speed derived in terms of x above and the relative speed of the train found out. x plus 6 into 5 divided by 18 is equal to 65 divided by 2, implies x plus 6 is equal to 65 into 18 divided by 2 into 5, implies x plus 6 is equal to 13 into 9 implies x plus 6 is equal to 117 implies x is equal to 111 kilometers per hour the speed of the train is 111 kilometers per hour let us see another example a train 150 meters long takes 5 seconds to cross a man walking at 8 kilometers per hour in the direction opposite to that of the train. Find the speed of the train. Let the speed of train be x kilometers per hour. As the train and man are moving in the opposite direction, their relative speed is the sum of their speeds. 
the relative speed is equal to speed of train plus speed of man is equal to x plus 8 kilometers per hour as length of train is in meters we convert the relative speed in kilometers per hour into meters per second by multiplying with 5 by 18 relative speed between man and train is equal to x plus 8 into 5 divided by 18 meters per second speed of train is equal to length to cross man divided by time taken by train to cross man here speed is the relative speed between man and train as they are in motion and the length to cross the man is the length of train which is crossed in 5 seconds relative speed of train is equal to length of train divided by time taken by train to cross man is equal to 150 divided by 5 is equal to 30 meters per second forming an equation equating the relative speed derived in terms of x above and the relative speed of the train found out x plus 8 into 5 divided by 18 is equal to 30 implies x plus 8 is equal to 30 into 18 divided by 5 implies x plus 8 is equal to 6 into 18 implies x plus 8 is equal to 108 implies x is equal to 108 implies x is equal to 100 kilometers per hour speed of the train is 100 kilometers per hour